This video covers how to install the Veil and Wasatch handle sets. If your door is not already prepped for the door hardware, please use the supplied template on how to prepare your door. Here are the tools you'll need to complete this installation. Let's get started. The first step is to install the latches. Note that the latch may need adjustment to match the bore depth of your door. To adjust the latch, find the stamp numbers that say 2 and 3 eighths and 2 and 3 quarters. Latches come preset at 2 and 3 eighths. If you need to adjust to 2 and 3 quarters, grab the latch face plate and latch body. Twist, pull, and twist. Now, install the deadbolt latch into the upper hole. Verify that the arrow is pointed in the up direction. Make sure that the crosshairs in the latch are towards the bottom of the latch and attach to the door using the supplied wood screws. Next, install the knob or lever latch into the bottom bore hole. Make sure to spin the latch tongue in the proper direction so that the door can close and latch matching the handing of your door. Next, install the latch cover plate and secure the latch using supplied 3 quarter inch wood screws. Next, we will begin to install the handle set. This step will be the same for both the Wasatch and Veil handle set. Using a third inch drill bit, carefully drill a hole through the door. Place on the door aligning the spindle for the thumb depressor with the handle set latch. Use a level to make sure exterior plate is square with the edge of the door. Verify the bottom post lines up with the mark that was made from the template. Place exterior handle set plate onto the door. Ensure the spindle engages and seats in the latch properly. You'll know it's correct if you depress the thumb depressor and it operates smoothly. Now let's install the deadbolt cylinder. First, locate the deadbolt cylinders, the two and a quarter inch deadbolt screws, and the mounting bracket. Install the cylinder carefully, ensuring the tailpiece on the deadbolt cylinder is installed horizontally into the crosshairs of the deadbolt latch. Grab the tailpiece with your fingers or pliers and turn to extend the bolt. If the tailpiece does not extend the bolt, remove the deadbolt cylinder. Turn the tailpiece 180 degrees and reinsert. Now, locate the mounting bracket and orient it with the single hole towards the top. Ensure this part of the bracket is inside the bore hole. Insert the deadbolt screws through the bracket, through the latch, and into the deadbolt cylinder. Tighten the screws until snug. No need to over tighten. Now we will install the interior trim. With the bolt of the deadbolt inside the door, orient the thumb turn vertically. Place the thumb turn over the mounting bracket so that it engages with the deadbolt tailpiece. Install the machine screws and hand tighten. If you have a separate knob or lever trim, Install the one and a quarter inch machine screws above and below. Now, let's finish the install. First, place the screw through the threaded washer. Then, screw it into the screw post and hand tighten. Now, screw the decorative cap onto the threaded washer. And with that, check to make sure that the handle set is functioning properly. Thank you for choosing Sherlock hardware to complete your home.